Okay, so I am charging my Blue Eddy AC200L with my 200 watt solar panel that is on top of my pop-up roof at this moment in time. So it's plugged in. And I will show you what it's reading on my app. It started off at 25% was getting really low and we'll see how long today it takes to charge it full from 25% with a 200 watt solar panel. All right, so I got I want to show you guys how I have my setup to charge my lithium battery with my all top battery box and a P20 Pro charger. It's currently plugged in to the house. I can also plug it in through solar. So it's almost charged, it's basically showing 13.5 and when it is fully charged, it will shut off. So that's when I plug it into shore power. Just like this on the outside. And if I want to plug it into my solar panel, I would take this off, this cover, and plug this in. And I would run that to this cord to the solar panel that is catching some sun right now for my battery box, my power bank, which is in there right now, charging separately. So I have my power bank charging off of solar and currently my tongue battery is charging off of shore power. It's nice to have the availability to either charge this from shore power with a battery charger or be able to plug it right into the same solar panel that I charge my power bank with just to top it up as well. As you can see, the kill switch is off. There's a digital readout here if I want to turn this on. See how that's doing. Like I said, currently 13.3 when it is completely charged with my P20 Pro charger. It will shut off automatically. And the battery will be all set for this coming weekend. Thank you very much. Feel free to drop any questions. I'm happy to answer them. Happy camping.